Okay, so here we go. Um, I already have like a stack of orders here. You know, some stuff, is it has to be special ordered. Some stuff I have in stock downstairs. Um, so I've gotten all these orders that just came in. All these saying, un un well, shoot, I don't know whose this is. This says unfulfilled. I'm waiting on this CKBE to come in. So let me see where I stopped at last. I think I got this. Oh, this is this order right here. So I'm waiting for Coach Legacy to come in. So I just need to print. Print these three orders. And then I'm going to go downstairs. Packing. Doing my packing slips. Uh, and then go down there and see what I have and what I can do. I might have to um, um, place some orders with my vendors or some. I have so much stuff already. Okay, so these are three orders that I have to review them to make sure. Do I have have all this in stock? I um, I gotta. This one, I know, I know I got some things on here that's special order. I even have a category on the product that says special order. So if someone orders it they uh, from the actual the website, they're going to know, okay, it may take a little long, maybe maybe two or three days to get it. Because um, like mango peach and mango, um, I don't know if I got all that downstairs in my basement. But here's one, black seed with shea butter soap. I am uh, almost totally convinced that I got this downstairs. I just have to go down there and just look. And as, as soon as I see that I got it, then I just go ahead and um, create the shipment. Ship the order, pack it, run my my, my uh, self on down to um, USPS. If this is USPS, if it, it may be UPS, um, then I just... Uh, it, I got I, well. I go to the UPS place. I think they closed. They closed not. Um, I don't know what time they closed on Saturday, but I think on the weekday then we close at seven. So this one here, I it's a lot. One, two, three, four, five, six. But I am sure I have all this downstairs. This lady wants all one ounce, one ounce bottles. Let me go. Let me take you downstairs. Show you where I go and do the rest. Look at here. I got ladies, men's fragrances, fragrance oils, oh, rebottled stuff. Oh, my peanuts. <gasps> okay. Oh, shirts and this stuff is on the website. This is crazy. Um, mm, mm, mm. that's all I gotta say. Stuff I need to add to to the um. What is it? Um, one website. Oh, let me show you this. Okay, so this is a humidifier. And it is the most bomb thing. So you can use it in your car. Um, thank you. Do you take the top off of it? Here we go. So put some water or put a little oil. I like to put a little oil, you know, put a little oil up to here, fill the rest of it with water. This is a filter. Um, it comes with one filter. So screw that back in, close that joker back up, put that in your car, plug it in. It is going to scent your car and it's gonna be a humidifier at the same time. Poof. Here is my slow laptop, but I have a hook to my my little label label printer here. So okay, in my perfect world, <laughs> here's how it's supposed to go. So I have this customer that ordered six six fragrances i've got all six fragrances in stock i'm gonna um 
I think I'm pretty much a little bit of a perfectionist. Um, hmm. So other entrepreneurs, you totally understand where I'm coming from. I'm going to set this order to ship. Yes. Order number 1239. I'm going to click on it. And I'm going to create my shipping label. And I've got all this wrap over here in the way. Okay. Because when this label comes out, it needs to not be in the way. Iris is going to ship this joker today. I'm going to run it on down there. It's shipping to Las Vegas, Nevada. She got all one ounce bottles. Um, already got already got the pack and slip printed. I'm gonna print. Um, I said I got the pack and slip ready, and I'm gonna print the shipping label. But no, Iris goes and clicks on the other thing. Okay, click on the shipping label. Make sure I choose the right printer. It's a four bar code. I got me on ooh, arc scan. I don't know if y'all can see that. This is dark. I need to get me a um, I think I need to get me a what do you call that? Um, light above this. I got a new uh GoPro, yeah. Let's see so that y'all can see everything that I'm doing, okay. I got this all together. Let's see. I got a um. So all these are gonna do. Let's see what I can do with these. I got a bottle of these. Watch this. So turn on my little brother and click OK because I'm gonna create a label. Woo! Mm, I don't think y'all can see that, but watch. I'm gonna do one. Let's see. Back this up. I'm going to print out. God, back up, Iris. I'm going to print out one for gyps Gypsy Water. Isn't that an interesting name? That is why my company is called Unique Oils because I love all these names. It's so neat. And I'm going to print one. I got junk in the way. Boom. Gypsy water. So I'm going to cut this label. I don't have my trash can down here. Oh my gosh. I'm about to make a whole mess. A whole mess. Y'all literally need a store.
So because these are six, these are six glass bottles. I want to make sure it gets to them without being broken. I try to reinforce it a little bit. Let's see. Make it look kind of cute. Put them in here like this. Maybe three in each one. Yeah. It's nice. All nice and neat. Boom. And I ran out of business cards. So, oh, this is going to be a real feat trying to get over to this. Um, Oh, and then by the way, I am fully vaccinated. So, everything is good in here. Okay, maybe I need to put a little bit of something on top. I don't think anything will fit. Okay, well, I'm out of business cards. I usually put a business card in here, but I'm waiting for them to come in because I ran out. Slap that label on there. Mm -mm -mm. Looky, looky here, y'all. Looky, looky here. And it is going UPS ground. All I got to do is take it all down there and say, hey, y'all. <gasps> oh! So, let me see what they're talking about on here. Somebody's talking to me. They, they talk to me on... Facebook, plus I uh, have th those three websites, so I have to see where they, oh, oh, someone gave, someone like said something, a compliment, what did they say? I love these incense bottles, yes they do, they said, oh yeah, it does have a, a hole in it, hi, I love these incense bottles. Question, does the bottle have a small hole in the bottom back? I think I see one in the back in the photo, but I want to clarify. Well, what's this person's name? Okay, Kanga. Kanga, and they're in New Hampshire. Hi, Kanga. Thank you very much. I am happy you love the incense bottles yes this one has a hole small hole small hole in the bottom back area let me do it the way it's just got here back area there is also a uh, what do you call that thing? It's like a um, well, I'm just gonna say that because I don't know exactly. So I guess she'll go ahead and purchase it. 